Niggas be thinking I'm deep, intelligent, fooled by my college degree. My IQ is average, there's a young lady out there, she way smarter than me. I scroll through her timeline in these wild times and I started to read. She mad at these crackers, she mad at these capitalists, mad at these murder police. She mad at my niggas, she mad at that ignorance, she wear a heart on her sleeve. She mad at the celebrities, low key I be thinking she talking about me. Now I ain't no dummy to think I'm above criticism, so when I see something that's valid, I listen for shit. There's something about the queen tone that's bothering me. She strike me as somebody blessed enough to grow up in conscious environment. With parents that know about the struggle for liberation and in turn they provide it with a perspective and awareness of the system and a fairness that afflicts them and a clearest understanding of what we got to do to get free. And the frustration that feels the worst seems to come from the fact that most people don't see. Just cause you woke and I'm not, that shit ain't no reason to talk like you better than me. How you gonna leave when you attacking the very same niggas that really do need? This shit that you saying, instead of command, you holier, come help us get her to speed. Shit, it's a reason it took like two and a year's why it answers is just to get free. These shots gonna be locking the mental way more than the physical. I look at freedom like trees, can't grow for us like overnight. Hit the ghetto and slowly start planting your seeds. Fuck is the point of you preaching your message to those that already believe what you believe? I'm also fucking retweet, most people are sheep. You got all the answers, but how you gonna reach? If I can make one more suggestion respectfully, I would say it's more effective than treat. People like children, understanding the time and love and patience that's needed to grow. This change is inevitable, but ain't none of us seen this before. Therefore, we just gotta learn everything as we go. I struggle with thoughts on the daily, feel like a slave to somehow to say that no coins to buy us way about a slavery. Think it just maybe in my pursuit to make life so much better for me and my babies. I done betrayed the very same people that look at me like I'm some kind of a hero because of the seriousness of the comments. But look here, I promise I'm not who you think. Ran into this nigga outside of the store yesterday. He said something that had me like, wait. He was like, oh, appreciate what you been doing, my nigga. That's real. But damn, why I feel fake and there's snow on the bluff? Or maybe because deep down I know I ain't doing enough. Hello babes, welcome back to another video. I am Monet Sheree. If you have never been to the channel, welcome and welcome back to those who know what's going on. Okay. So um this week I'm gonna be getting ready. Um getting ready for my boyfriend's graduation party and his actual graduation, which will be Friday and Saturday of this week. So excited for him. Um he'll probably end up seeing this video, but yes. By the time you see this, you will you will be have graduated and everything moved on. <laughs> but congratulations to my boyfriend on graduating from his undergrad program. So 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 proud of you. So um yeah, that's pretty much what I'm what this video is about. I'm gonna be getting my stuff together for this graduation party because y'all his not not his not his main family members not his main family immediate family but his pretty much his whole family is about to be at this graduation party so we we gotta snatch it back 
get right because the look at the head we did the skin um anytime i derma plane my skin gets really red so you guys don't have to worry about that but um that's pretty much what happened in the first part of the video like my shower derma plane skin all that and um yeah so I was like, let me pick up the camera because, you know, this is good content to get. And I did, like I said, I dermaplane my face. Um, I showed you guys pretty much all the products that I use for dermaplaning. I keep it simple. I don't do too much because the skin can only take so much at one time. But, um, yeah, so we, we're trying to get right, begin right this week. And I'll be, like, recording different parts of me, like, getting myself together um, on different days. Today is Sunday. So, yeah, I'm not going to tell y'all what day it is anymore after this. But, yeah, I'm just going to be popping back in and getting things done. I think I actually want to take my braids out tonight because I plan to wash my hair on Thursday of this week. So, um, I'm going to just take the braids out, let my hair be out for two or three days. And then I will wash my hair. And that is actually a different video that I have to record um, for a brand. So most likely you guys will not see that part. Well, you'll see the part before that, but you won't see like me actually doing the content. So, um, yeah. Make sure you guys, if I haven't said it so many times already, make sure you guys give this video a big thumbs up. It's very helpful that you like the video. If you like the video it is helpful to the algorithm because it'll continue to push my videos out to other people and just keep on helping us grow our community so i will check in with you guys um after i go eat something because i'm hungry before i start taking any type of braids down and then we're gonna get a list of shows together to watch and start taking the tear down Alright y'all, finally got all my hair taken out, it's 1246, I'm about to go to bed because I have work in the morning, so yeah, I'll catch up with y'all a little bit later in the week. One more thing, so now that I finished taking my hair out, I mean I am going to wash it on Thursday and we're going to do one of the wigs that I got sent um for the graduation party so yeah hey guys so this is part two of getting ready with me for my boyfriend's graduation um don't mind this right here i was kind of like scratching my skin so um i want to say thank you to Ariane. Ariane Beauty for providing me with today's hair care products. Um, we will be trying out and reviewing their products right here on the channel. So I will give you guys what my thoughts are as a natural hair girly um, for these products. So I'm going to go ahead and show you guys all the products that we'll be using in the routine today. And this will also be linked down in the description box. I will probably be I will probably be doing a voiceover for this part of the video um, just because I will be in the shower washing my hair. I do have a discount code for these products. Um, that will be down in the description box as well. If you guys want to know more about these products, make sure you keep on watching. And let's get right into it. Alright you guys, so I'm going to start off with of course rinsing my hair and you guys saw all the products thank you again to cat professional for sending me their line of products and we're gonna get right into it all right guys so first i'm gonna go in with cat professionals argan oil hair shampoo and this is a repair shampoo i'm also gonna go in with their conditioner which helps to bring back moisture to to dry hair and it makes the hair stronger after each wash I can definitely attest to how much softer my hair felt and you guys will see the results once I get to the blow dry process but for right now I'm just going in and 
really getting my scalp clean before we go through the blow dry process. So, of course, next we're going to go in with their Argan Oil Moisture Shampoo. You guys, I really, really, I'm not shampoo. I'm so sorry. We're going to go in with their Moisture Conditioner. And you guys see the consistency. I showed you guys the consistency of their shampoo. And this is the conditioner. I would say that you should, of course, apply a, a needed, a, a as needed amount of conditioner just because you want the hair to be really really slick when you're going through and brushing it so i used about like i want to say two dime size not dime size two quarter size amounts of conditioner just to make sure everything was slick and of course it just gave you like a really good amount of slip to do the brushing So after shampooing and conditioning, I'm going to go in with Cat Professionals Moisture Repair Spray. And this helps to tame frizz and it also doubles as a heat protectant spray. So I'm just going to go in and of course I went ahead and, and applied it all over my hair. And I'm, now I'm just kind of like rubbing it all through so that it can be evenly distributed before I go in with the blow dryer. Just because we want everything to be very smooth and just like their spray does, we want our hair to be very tame and not frizzy. After blow drying, I'm going to go ahead and go in with Cap Professional Argan Oil Repair Hair Serum. And you guys, this is probably one of my favorite, favorite products. This helps to repair split ends and add shine back to the hair. And you guys will see a little bit later in the video and just this whole section of me blowing drying my hair, how bouncy and full and shiny the hair looks after blow drying. So make sure you guys keep watching to see that. So you guys, my overall review of the products, y'all, I literally love 
every single one of the products my hair came out smelling so good my hair was beyond soft like crazy soft and it was just so smooth and as you guys can see like there's no flyaways because of the serum you guys if you don't get anything else get the serum because unbelievable and to make you guys day I have an exclusive code use my code monet15 I'll put it on the screen for you guys go down in the description box and pick up some of cat professionals products because if you don't then y'all y'all missing out y'all missing out and I want you guys to get these same results so go get it Hey babes, so it is another day um, with this, can we call this a vlog? Yeah, it's another day with this vlog, so um, as you guys can see, I am prepping the wig for, for tomorrow. Tomorrow is Friday, so today is Thursday. Um, we're getting closer to my boyfriend's graduation party and his graduation. He graduates in two days. Um, I'm so excited, but right now I'm getting the wig together, so I went ahead and washed it. Um, a little update on this wig though. Um, when I first installed this wig, I did not wash it, and I should have. Next time I will, but I did not wash it. This time when I washed it, y'all, the color, it, like, I'm not sure if it, if it was because it's dirty or the color was the color was coming off a little bit but I mean it's still ginger like it didn't change it too much but yeah I washed the wig and a lot of the color seemed like it was coming out but I need to reset I need to reset this wig the baby hairs the parting all that um so that tomorrow when I head out and um and I get there I can just put the wig on um, because I still have practice today and tomorrow um, in the morning, so I'm not going to be wearing a wig while I'm practicing. I need to um, braid my hair down tighter because I feel like my hair isn't flat enough. Like, it's kind of poofy right here, so I need this to be snatched or something. I don't know. Yeah, so I need to figure that out. But, yeah, y'all, this is pretty much what is going on right now. And I've been forgetting that green light is on. So, yeah, the lights are hitting the camera. Also, I'm just watching YouTube right now while I do everything. But, my hair smells so good, y'all. The products, the products I used earlier, y'all should definitely get them. Because they did me. They did me right but let me go ahead and get into this wig um it's 11 17 right now and i pretty much have the day to myself until like three o'clock so i will get these get my hair situated first
for life. 